Welcome back Mears, you're building with Captain Crayfish. There's a few changes in all these updates. Uh, let's have a look. First of all, we've got this Mears Pass and uh, I can see there, you know, that I've... Uh, uh, it's, it's, I suppose it's really good that I get a reward um, as we go along. I haven't purchased the Premium Pass, only because uh, 15 bucks is a lot of money. Mind you, if you put it into context, it's like three cups of coffee. But um, I'm reluctant to um, spend any more money. I'm looking at that there up at the top there and it says ends in 52 days. I'll see how I go. If I think I've got a huge chunk of these, um, I might consider purchasing it. But in, inside the game now, there's a, a heap of money. There's a heap of things that do with money now. And I can see it's all focused on making money. So you gotta, you got to basically uh, pick and choose, pick and choose. Because you can't afford to go and buy everything, and that's the last thing I want to do. Um, just a little bit of an update: all my all my areas now, my um, regions, are all over one million. Um, it's taken a bit. I can see that once one of the keys <coughs> is going to be um, these. It's going to be these ends here. These things here. Um, they're specialised region. Um, specialised region um areas and you get to update them and i've got a couple now that are that are quite up there in um in amounts and levels uh they do take a bit of buying and purchasing i've figured out that it's quite achievable if you buy things not not spend any real cash but buy them in there um steer clear of these piggy banks Although, uh, what happens with the piggy banks is that as you, um, as you achieve every level in here, so in here there's usually three or six, as you achieve them, they, uh, they give you a bronze, silver or, or gold pig, which um, you can actually purchase like 8,000 of these um, regional currencies at a time. Um, I've only done that once. Because I was, I was interested in seeing how it goes. Anyway, today I just want to have a look at this, the um, specialised epics in your areas. And um, I wanted to get something that looks, that will go with, the, go with the territory, with the region. And the ones that they've got so far do actually match the region. Um, you have to place them next to one of these uh, to start getting the upgrades. So I've got an epic building here. I've got an epic building and she's going to get upgraded and I've got education as factors and I'm going to pop it in and I've got 23 hours now while that's going you can see a whole heap of number threes pop up um, because what I do what I do usually do is I go and borrow um, high-end stuff from my capital and I place it in there so it gives me more options so in here I'll go and hunt for my for a school. Education, there we go. I'll have a look to see which one actually gets the one. I want that one. I will store it. I'll bring it back. But I just want to store it. So that I can upgrade all those other areas really quick and then I'll go and put them back. So just have to sort of work it to your advantage. Because those threes are the keys. You want those threes. Um, because uh, it makes life a lot more easier when you're spending all this cash. Let's modify some of my areas here. So I can fit these big scores. And I can pop them in. And that's only for the duration of um, this epic upgrade and there should be another three up. Okay, so I'll pop that one here, There's another one. And I will pop one in here. And at the end of the um at the end of it all I'll go and pop it back into my capital. I only used to get it from my capital. Because uh, my capital can sustain quite a, I'm not, um, quite a lot of hits before, uh, without affecting my population, my regional population. So look at that. Now I've got all these number threes. 
I'll go and check over in the over in here because sometimes they have uh, epic plate. Oh wow, it's only that's not much. Never mind, that'll do. Pop it in there, and then I go Listen for thin start. Heading up now. This is only twenty, so it shouldn't take very long. In fact, it's not going to take long at all. But yeah, see, the, it's a lot easier when you go three, 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 and I can get that um, those twenty units in a very, very short amount of time. Look at that. And that's what you'll do. You've got to, you've got to uh, work it to your advantage. So three. How long is it going to take me to get to earn that twenty? Mm, couple of, not even a minute. Just going to wait for that to pop up again. Like, um, oh, I've got those. Uh, I usually try and target at least um, silver token. Okay, keep your factory pumping. I basically keep the same. Tons of watermelons. And boom. There you go. Got that. Mears award. Yes. Now it does pay to. Sometimes they pop up with another one. Uh, in this case, they haven't. Yeah. So another hint. Look at that number three. I'm easily going to get this up. Piece of cake. Um, the other advantage I have is I've got a. I've got. Um, want to have a look at that. Yeah, my city storage is up to 610 and I just keep keep piling it on because the more you have the more you can stockpile and the more you stockpile the more options you can do that. How long is it going to take me to get up there? Yeah, so that's my little installment today. That's at um, the epics. Um, inside the regions, uh, I'm predicting that that's, that's going to um, be pretty good. Again, the other thing I'm doing in this area is <clears throat> um, you can see these grids that I've got. You'll find these grids in all my lands, in all my regions. Uh, finally, I've earned enough to um, to buy all the regional territories and in, in, in a few of them. Uh, mainly, I got all my um, expansions from my feeder cities and yeah so if you i will do a little installment later on about feeder cities feeder cities work and keep them at 10 because you get it you actually get a ton of really major expansions if you keep it at level 10 and that's there i've uh <clears throat> finally expanded all the areas in here as well again can you see those good formats you want to save money that you got to use that go and have a look at my other videos it actually explains uh, why I've put those in there and how I've gone about putting those in there. Uh, my Sunny Isles, just another visit there. Yeah, uh, I will do another one on how to buy those big capital units. I'll show you what I mean. Uh, these ones here. These ones, the Megas. Uh, using those. Using those. They actually, I use them to store. Because I haven't got a lot of, um, I can only earn up to 30 on here. Uh, but I use them to store these this near bank currency. And then I, that's how I buy all my uh, major upgrades and Amiga and the major Amiga upgrades. Sorry. Yeah. So that's my little installment for today. Hope you found this useful. And keep building, guys. Keep building, team.